Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to explore Microsoft New A Lava about Microsoft Lava, Large Language and Vision Assistant, is a new multimodal AI model that can both chat and understand images. It is trained on a massive dataset of text, code, and images, and can perform a wide range of tasks features multimodal understanding. LLAV can understand and process both text and images which allows it to generate more comprehensive and informative responses. Conversational capability. LLAVA can engage in natural language conversations with users, answering their questions and following their instructions. Generative ability. LLAVA can generate different creative text formats of text content, like poems, code, scripts, musical pieces, email, letters, etc. Instruction following capability. Lava can follow instructions and complete requests without fully, even if they are open and dead, challenging, or strange. Advantages A student could use LLAVA to get help with their homework, even if the assignment is complex or involves multiple subjects. A researcher could use LLAVA to help them develop new ideas and to find relevant information from a variety of sources. A business could use LLAVA to improve their customer service, to develop new products, and to market their products more effectively. Dark side misinformation and disinformation. LLAVA could be used to generate realistic but false information, which could be used to spread misinformation and disinformation. For example, LLAVA could be used to create fake in news articles or social media posts that are designed to deceive people. Deepfakes LLAVA could be used to create deepfakes, which are videos or audio recordings, that have been manipulated to make it look or sound like someone is saying or doing something that they never actually said or did. Deep fakes could be used to damage someone's reputation or to interfere with an election. Bias. LLAVA is trained on a massive dataset of text and code, which means that it could reflect the biases that are present in that data. For example, if LLAVA is trained on a dataset that is mostly made up of male authors, it may be more likely to generate text that is biased against women. Job displacement. LLAVA could be used to automate tasks that are currently done by humans, which could lead to job displacement. For example, LLAVA could be used to generate news articles, write marketing copy, or even translate languages. This could put many people out of work. That's all for today, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like it. I also love to hear from my viewers, so please leave a comment below and let me know what you thought of the video. I'm always looking for feedback on how I can improve my content. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.